I love my Rhodes Quartz Crystal. <laughs> my Rose Quartz Crystal. Um, and I keep it in the freezer and then I just rub outward to reduce inflammation. And it's amazing and it works every time. But hi, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hi, I'm Mary. Subscribe for more. Also, follow me on Insta. It's linked down below. And you should totally do it because then you can keep up with everything in my life. And I'm literally always posting on there. I'm going to be posting a ton on there because I'm actually going to Australia. Um, so Insta will be like my main mode of communication. So if you don't follow me, you totally should to keep up with that trip and just for everything. But I just made... A fresh green juice it's pretty simple today it's literally just like cucumber celery fennel um so it's gonna be nice and chill but I'm gonna show you guys what I got for my 21st birthday oh my god that's so good holy shit um, I realized I hadn't shown you guys that, so I was like, okay, well, I need to show them. So I'm going to sit down, and I'm going to show it to you, but I'm still going to do it vlog style, because why not? We love a good vlog. Hey, guys. Okay, here I am, just chilling, and I'm finally going to show you guys, because I wanted everything to come in. I wanted to compile everything, and honestly, I put in a lot of thought as to whether I was going to film this or not. Um... Like a what I got for my 21st birthday or whatever, haul 2019. And uh, I don't know, I was just kind of like back and forth about it because I think people get really judgmental when it comes to these videos and can just say things and I don't know, just, it's just stupid. But it's, I just want to put out that disclaimer that like, I am so blessed for every single gift that I got. And I'm so, so, and completely and utterly grateful for everyone in my family and all of my friends who gave me these gifts. Um, and yeah, cheers to 21, baby. Um, if you have anything to say that's not kind, I would reflect twice before you say it. Um... And just know that everyone's in a different position. And yeah, I'm really, really grateful for all of these gifts. So I just thought it would be kind of fun. I love watching these. So everyone loves watching these because they're nosy as fuck and they just give good gift ideas. So I just figured why not? And yeah, let's just like hop right into it. Okay, so the first like section of gifts that I want to go through is just going to be like gifts from my friends. And so I'm going to like name the gift that or I'm going to name the friend and then I'm going to like name the gifts that they gave me. Um, just so you guys can kind of see like what little things my friends got me. I think that these were really, really thoughtful gifts. And I think they could be really thoughtful gifts for like a lot of people interested in things that I'm interested in. So um, yeah, I'm like really, really grateful for my friends for like getting these things for me and like thinking about that because... I don't know. I was just like shocked and was not expecting to get gifts from them at all. And it was really, really sweet. So, um, first thing is my friend Iris. You guys may have seen this. You And you guys may have seen most of this if you've already seen my vlogs. Um, but I'm still going to go through it. So, my friend Iris got me, uh, first of all, she got me a light pink stasher bag because she knows I love the color pink. And I love stasher bags. I literally put everything in them. I think they're such a great alternative to plastic bags. They're amazing. And then she also got me this all natural handcrafted hand salve um, from this rare bird soap shop. And it's in the flavor lemongrass. And it literally smells so good. The ingredients are so clean. It's basically just like oils, shea butter, and lemongrass essential oil. Like literally so good. And then she got me this perfume oil and it's like stress free and so it's like lavender rosemary and spearmint and it smells oh so good it's so relaxing and she got it for me because she knows I can just like get very on edge with things so that was so thoughtful and then she also the last thing she got me is peanut butter that's like already almost gone oh because it's so good and it's this lady called Betsy's Best 
and she only sells her peanut butter on Amazon and it's so good if you haven't tried it you totally need to try it like it's seriously so good and this one is cinnamon with chia seeds and it tastes almost like an oatmeal raisin cookie like it's that good I'm obsessed with it like seriously you should try it next is my friend Claire and she got me this cute little mug um it just has hearts on it and yeah I just think it's really cute and I'm probably just gonna like put tea in it and stuff it's cute um, and then my friend Hannah got me this, this was literally so thoughtful and she got me a paint by numbers, like wall art, because first of all, I can't paint. And second of all, it's just like a fun thing to do, but it's like the moon and the mountains and I'm such a mountain girl. And then there's like stars in the sky and I'm just, I'm like hanging this in my bathroom. I still need to hang it up, but in my bathroom, like above my toilet. Um, but I literally think it's so pretty and it was so fun to do especially because like I do feel like I have an artistic soul but like I just am not like the most outwardly artistic person um so it was just like a really fun thing for me to be able to do and then she also got me this lotion bar from the brand Moon Valley Organics and it's crazy because I had a lotion or I have a lotion bar that's almost gone by the same brand um in a different scent and she actually got me the scent geranium something i'm not sure maybe i'll like link it down below if i can find it or i'm sure you can find it on their website it's just moon valley organics like geranium something but geranium has been like my all-time go-to like comforting scent since i was like so young like it's literally oh it's my thing i love it so those were such thoughtful gifts as well and yeah now moving on to jess jess got me this amazing robe from pb teen and it's just like this like polar bear like i think it's so cute because it's like a snow leopard um just like robe i was looking for like a plush comfy robe for so long and i almost bought one in chicago like literally i almost got the barefoot dreams one i like this one so much better the barefoot dreams one's ugly um but and then she presented me with this gift and i was like holy fucking shit i've been wanting this forever like jess you just know me and so i'm literally so happy she got me this like this was this is a great gift so thoughtful but also like so useful like i wear it every day like it's just an amazing gift like really love this one good job jay okay next is from blake and blake i think you guys kind of know already like i showed this in a vlog too but blake got me this ring if you can see it it's the croissant ring maybe i will just like link all this stuff down below i think i'm going to but um it's a croissant ring from marjorie or however the fuck you say it um but i really love it he knew i wanted a ring to wear like i have this one that has an m on it and then i've been just like off and on wearing a ring on this finger but he knew i wanted one for like my middle finger on this finger and so he got me this one and i think it's so pretty and just like a really just like a classic timeless piece that i will wear every day so I absolutely love that and then he obviously like took me out to dinner and wrote me a letter and just things like that also all of my friends wrote me like fire or most of my friends wrote me like fire letters like so beautiful so like that was like the part that i was most grateful for like honestly is like shout out to you guys for like writing me awesome letters like wow i'm so completely grateful for you guys Okay, I'm chugging this green juice. Take a step back, Mary. Um, now, moving on to the gifts from my parents. My mom got me some slip hair ties because she knows that, she just like loves giving those as gifts and like she knows that I wear them all the time. Like you guys know I'm fucking obsessed with these things. Like they're the best. Like they're amazing. They're why my hair is curly right now. They they just like really vibe with me like they just they hit me where it hurts you know i don't know i <laughs> i don't really know what that meant but i really really like them um and they're they're just like crease free they don't like fuck with your hair and make you have a bunch of ugly ass split ends 
they feel good, you feel bougie as fuck because you're wearing sl silk little hair ties. That's how I feel about my pillowcase too. Like, yeah, it works, but also I feel like a fucking princess. Um, so yeah, she got me some of those. We like got a pack of six in Chicago and then we ended up just like splitting it out three and three. Um, and then she also got me this candle, which is the Lalabo Suntol. So you guys know probably if you watch my vlogs that I am obsessed with the um, Mason Louis Marie candle um, that it smells exactly like Suntol. Like it is literally the Lo Labo dupe. Like it smells exactly like it. Um, but, so I'm always bringing that one because that one's like 30 bucks and this one's like 70. Um, but my mom got me this one and I was like, an angel? Like we were at Lo Labo and I thought that she was just gonna get one for herself because like I know she likes to burn them at home and stuff. And I was like, she, she like got two and I was like, wait, is one for me? And she was like, yeah, you thought that I wasn't going to get you one? I was like, mom, she was like, I'm not going to do that. I was like, I don't know. I just, I'm fine. I'm just chilling. But anyways, it was really, really sweet of her. So like, I'm only burning on special occasions, boy. Very excited. Um, and then going along with the Lalabo theme, Suntol, she got me this new one um i wear the suntol perfume it lasts forever it's amazing um but she got it for me and it says happy birthday mary on it if you can see it oh, you probably can't but it says for like there's a little like compounded like in bloomingdale's on blank for happy birthday mary so super cute all right dan next is I just needed more of my Kopari Coconut Crush Scrub. So she got me more of that. Um, not very exciting, but that stuff is amazing. It makes me just feel really good. It exfoliates, but it also moisturizes. And it also smells so good. So I'll do it like once a week in the shower. I do it before I shave, but never when I have a tan on because it like rubs your tan off. Um, it's just like really awesome. I really like it. Okay, moving on to clothing items. Super exciting. Um, I actually think I got some really good pieces. Just, I didn't get like a ton. Um, I just got a few things in Chicago. Um, and then my mom got me something in Iowa City. So, yeah. The first thing is this. Fuck, it's black so you can't see it. This is going to be like half the things. But it's this like, you can kind of see the cutout. But it's this top like this <laughs> that didn't make any sense but it's this just this like top and it hits like three quarter lengths and it's actually a bodysuit um but it has like a really like you can see the cutout it's like square shaped cutout and it's literally so cute um i wore it on my 21st birth forced birthday <laughs> first birthday with a jacket that I'll show later and it was literally so cute and it's by free people and I like free people stuff but I wasn't expecting them to have something like that so I'm really happy that they did because I'm vibing with it hard fucking cord boy um next is another thing that I wore on my actual birthday and it is again if you've watched my vlogs you've probably seen this stuff so you can watch again or you can not watch. Whichever you prefer. Uh, sorry, I'm in such a weird mood right now. Um, but the next thing is just this little light blue action Aritzia turtleneck cropped a little bit and sleeves that are just like a little bit, they're a little bit like, um, not fitting and then they come to fit they're really cute i really that smell like hannah's body bar that smells literally so good um but i really like that and i'm not actually like a blue person i just like kind of wear a lot of neutrals um and then i'll pop in some prints like i do love my prints i'm looking at my closet right now i do love a good print i love stripes i love cheetah print i love camo things like that but I never really go for like a bright blue. Um, but I've been really gravitating towards light pink and like bright pink. Like 
just, I don't know, a pinky color recently. I don't know what it is, but I'm obsessed. Next is this little Aritzia. It's a bodysuit as well, and it's black, and it's almost like a, like, Oxford, but it doesn't have, like, you can, oh, fuck, this is so hard to show. It's like this. I should honestly just try this stuff on, but I'm not going to, sorry. But it's like this, and then it's just like really low cut. And again, I wore this in one of my vlogs, so if you haven't seen my vlogs, you should totally watch them. Um, but super low cut, super fun. I really like it. I vibe with it. I'll link all this stuff down below if I can find it. Um, and then one of the final clothing items is these Legence jeans. Um, and they're just like this like almost brownish like dark khaki not even i don't even know what color they would be let's see if it says no but they're amazing i really like them they're so comfy legence are definitely the best denim um if you haven't watched like my fall fashion faves video you should check that out because i talk about legence a lot they're really awesome um on the pricier end but do such a good job so i majorly vibe with that all right we're getting to the end of this haul we have two items left and the first one is this reformation cheetah print coat i think it's so damn cute it's like a little like puffy ish coat fur so cute i wore it out to my birthday dinner in chicago and it was so cute and i really really love it um i love reformation stuff and i just thought that was a really cute piece and i like wanted a cheetah print blazer for a while then i told my mom that and she was like why would you want a cheetah print but print blazer i was like i don't know and i think i saw one on like pinterest or something that i was like oh that's actually really cute but anyways then i found this and i think this is like so cute so really love it okay moving on to the final gift this is definitely a big gift um and this was like my like birthday gift um so for my 21st birthday i like it's 21 it's a big number whatever um so i like decided i like thought about for a while what i wanted and i decided i wanted a bag and i was like okay so what bag do i want i knew i wanted a bag that could fit my computer in it that i could like take with me to study but it still could be dressed up that it was crossbody um my sister has this one like prada bag and i really like the style of it um but i just like didn't know which route i wanted to go um and then finally after searching on Pinterest for a while, I found this bag. Um, and it's by Saint Laurent, Saint Laurent, and it's by Saint Laurent. And I really am into it. It's black, and it's called the Sac du Jour. Um, and it kind of just has everything I want. And I feel like it's really like me in a bag <laughs> because it's very, it's like cute put together i don't know if i'm put together but like whatever but like slightly edgy hence all of the f-bombs i don't know and so this is it and it has a crossbody um as you can see and then it just has like this little lock and key on the front and then in the bag you can see there's like two sections, which is amazing for organization. And then midway through there's a zipper and there's like a little pocket or actually a pretty sizable pocket. Um, and then on the sides of it, you can like unclip and just kind of pull out and the bag gets bigger. So yeah, the um, Saint Laurent Sac Du Jour and i am really obsessed with it i'm so excited and i got it in oh, what's the leather that i got it in it's like almost pebbly but it's not it's like a hard leather they told me that if i spill stuff on it that i can just like wipe it off and it will be fine because it has like a um 
like a waterproof and like proof coating or whatever. So I'll link it down below. Um, but yeah, I'm very excited to have this bag and I'm so excited to use it and all that jazz. I know it's going to, I'm going to get a lot of use out of it. Um, so yeah, that is my 21st birthday haul. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. Well, actually, I think I'm going to continue into a vlog, actually. I think that's kind of fun when, like, people sit down and then they, like, start vlogging. <laughs> but, um, so yeah, that's what I got for my 21st birthday. Um, again, just, like, please keep your opinions to yourself. Um, it's not, it doesn't do any good by putting out hate speech in any sort of a way even if it's not directly to me you're still sending that energy my way and it's just like that doesn't do any good that doesn't put you on a pedestal like it's really unnecessary it's gonna put you in a bad mood it's gonna put me in a bad mood it's just like not worth it so really just work to spread positivity and spread good energy um and I'm so grateful for all of these items that I got and sending you really great energy on this Christmas um and yeah i can't believe it's already christmas eve um so that's like 9 45. i am getting kind of hungry so i'm gonna make breakfast i still haven't have a coffee yet so i think it's coffee time um but yeah i think i'm just gonna continue into my day and keep on vlogging just got out of the shower and like okay so my shower like was not getting hot it was so weird so I was like okay well I'm not gonna waste this water waiting for it to get hot so I just like got in and took a cold shower and guys I kid you not it like at first I hated it but then it started to feel also notice the hole in my ceiling um they are doing a bunch of work in my apartment it's really annoying but it is what it is you know be like that um but the maintenance guys are so nice, so. Um, but anyways, I, um, yeah, I hated it at first, but then it got really, like, invigorating. It felt really good. And of course, I took, like, a two-minute, not even. I took, like, a m maybe 45-second, minute-long shower because it was so cold, but it felt so good. So I'm not washing my hair again. I'm hoping that it doesn't get, it, that it's not super greasy because it's been like two days since I've washed it. But I like don't really know what else to do because I mean, I'm not gonna go to my mom's just to wash my hair. I think I'll be fine. And I got this hair clip on Amazon. I think it's actually so cute. And I'm just gonna put my hair up with it. Um, and then I think I'm just gonna wear, I'll like show you guys what I'm wearing and stuff, but my mom wants to meet in like an hour and a half. So I need to like eat and start getting ready, I think. But it, it's so nice out. So I think I'm gonna wear a skirt with like my Stuart Weitzman boots and like a turtleneck. And yeah, I'll show you guys. We got a nice little ensalada here. And I'm filling up my Berkey water filter. Um, if you don't have a water filter, you should totally get one because it's one of the things that um, I figured out, like that I kind of correlated with breaking out was drinking unfiltered water and i know that sounds crazy but like the iowa water is not clean especially if you live in iowa city like know that like the iowa water is not clean at all if you live somewhere where the water is naturally clean by all means do not filter your water um but if you're just drinking tap water i really recommend that you get a water filter um just because it will filter out all of that bullshit and i don't know i think it's just so important to like 
eat clean but also drink clean in terms of like water, whatever, alcohol, all of that jazz. Um, so yeah, I love my Berkey water filter. It's amazing. Um, if you're looking for a splurge, 10 out of 10 recommend it. It's also like weirdly cute and correlates with my sink, or correlates, <laughs> matches with my sink. And yeah, I just really vibe with it. Um, but like Brita filters are like amazing too. So just like make sure you filter your water, people. Cause that can be a, a dicey, dicey road. <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna eat. <laughs> um, so I'm running to mass to meet my fam. I'm wearing, well, my mom and like her family. I'm wearing this black cashmere sweater, mini rose, I think this is autumn cashmere, mini rose, I think it might be cashmere as well, skirt, and then Stuart Weitzman booties. And yeah, I'm off because I'm gonna be late. So I'm just gonna take my bag and film.